Okay. And one of my new series I'm going to start is news series on uh, maybe I'll call it strange things that happen to YouTubers. So in this first one, and maybe that won't be the title, but let's look at DIY games. And he recently announced that he will no longer be doing car videos. In other words, videos where he's actually doing uh getting more car be done. Oh my god. This is why it took two weeks. <laughs> you can fix your hair for two weeks. <laughs> What's going on you guys? So listen, this is the deal. Yes, I am rebranding. Yes, I'm pivoting to a different space. And as far as my uncle's truck, you guys, just know that my uncle's truck is getting done and it is freaking sick. But as far as going through and breaking down vehicles and, and talking, yeah, I'm done with that. Like I really am. There's so much of it and there's only one of my family and I'd rather just have fun vlogging and having fun. And he announced it here that who's no longer doing car videos. And of course, you know, the people that came to your channel all 530K came because he did this amazing uh, car video of this burnt up Hellcat and how he refurbished. And it was a huge task, a lot of work. So I'm gonna, I'm gonna be honest with you, I get why maybe he decided that, uh, you know, he's not gonna do those bills anymore. And, uh, you know, yes, he's finished his uncle's truck. I know some folks up there, but after long consideration, this is the right route for my family. Nobody can argue with that. Uh, those who stay, thanks. And those who leave, appreciate the support and have a happy life. Now, I get that, you know, you're going to do what's good for your family first and foremost, because this, this kid was spending weeks and months doing bills and uh, it was ridiculous the amount of time that he was spending just building the cars. So I can see that. I can see him saying, you know, this, this is not good for me. But let's look at another reason why, because basically you're gonna take a hit on your subscribers and you're gonna get some people that, you know, may or may not stick around. Me personally, I'm not looking to you know, watch another family channel. But again, I get it. But let's look at something else here. Because before this, he was making quite a bit of money. And now if you look at this, what his social blaze number show is Zero earnings, a negative eighteen million one hundred and sixty-two point three million views, and a drop of thirty-eight point seven percent in subscribers. So that's a huge decision to make. And I always say extreme decisions uh, don't always come easy unless you're forced to make an extreme decision. And I ain't saying that's what happened here, but you know, I'm just looking at $20,378,497 and I'm not accusing anybody of anything, but usually when you see a drop like this, it's either a couple of things. You remove a very popular video 
and I don't know if he had one video on this date that was 20 million views. The other reason is YouTube does an audit and they remove the views or they remove the subscribers. And usually if YouTube removes your subscribers or views, it's because of uh, either they were bought, I'm not saying they bought them, either they were dead subscribers, not physically dead, but subscribers that, you know, they haven't watched the video in decades, <laughs> but they on your channel. But it really doesn't add up why you would why you would uh, just cut off your major income like that unless somebody cut it off for you. Now he has another channel. The other thing that could have happened and that could be happened is there's a transition where he's transitioning and this is Farfetch, where he's transitioning this channel to his family channel. I don't believe that to be the case, but it's possible. It's possible where you could be going to this family, the DIY family. But if that's happening, I don't know how it's gonna happen. And as you can see, that change hasn't came to this channel yet. So, eh, it's, it's something strange that you would all of a sudden give up a channel that you was making 12, 13,000, you know, 10,000, a lot of money a month. And all of a sudden you give it up. This kind of a drastic change doesn't hit unless you're forced to hit it. I mean, everybody wants to spend time with their family, but you also need income. And of course his wife works, I think she's a nurse, so I don't think financially, you know, it's, uh, well, I won't say it's not that big a deal, but financially it might just be a wash. You know, he gets to spend time with his family, his wife works, and the channel, the other channel can take off. But it's strange how this channel just went to zero. And, you know, Lost 20 million subs. I mean, views in a day. Yeah. Yeah. Just kind of, you know, looking at it and seeing exactly, exactly what happened is kind of, this is kind of weird. This is strange. Yeah. This is very strange. So, I mean, don't get me wrong. I admire people that want to spend time with their family. And sometimes when you, when you work as hard as this kid was, you probably need to take a break. Because I mean, when I used to watch his videos, it's like, you know, he would leave, get a couple hours of sleep, come back, or just wouldn't leave, just work all night. And you, you can't keep that going. I would think what he what he could do is reduce the number of hours. You can still do car refurbs without that extreme um, work load, without that extreme level of effort. You know, because people still like seeing the cars. I mean, that's mainly not watch the channel. So I don't know. You two cut your money off or your money gets zapped. You know, I'm just saying. 
You don't really just give up this kind of money. I mean, okay, you 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 can give up this kind of money if it's affecting your family, but most people aren't going to give up this kind of money. The kind of money that he was making on this channel, it's, it was it was up there. He was making a killing. So we'll see. I wish him the best of the best of luck and success on the other channel. It's not for me. But uh when you got 530 subscribers, you can transition and probably take about a third of those subscribers with you. Maybe. He was a heavy car community guy. I don't know if a lot of car guys gonna, you know, do the family stuff. You know, yeah. it's definitely not for me, but we'll see. But anyway, best of luck. Just thought I'd brought, bring this out here and just kind of look at it and just uh, look at how strange it is. 20 million sub. I mean, 20 million views, not sub. 20 million views, just zap. I mean, you're still getting good views. And this, this part right here, YouTube, for some reason, doesn't put out the uh, sub counts like they used to, so they just kind of average it. But, yeah. Anyway, peace. Later. Okay, I had to add on to this video because I think I see what happened. Apparently, for some reason, he zapped all his videos. But you see he only had he only had seven uploads. And I know for a fact his channel had way more than these uploads. One, two, three, four, five. It's seven. He had way more than this. I mean so maybe he could be going to the Patreon thing, because I do see on his channel, he got a Patreon link. So, I mean, that could be it. Uh, he got Discord. I don't know, it's just, you know, I don't really try to get in people's business, but this is a drastic change. You zap all your videos, you decide to go to a family channel and you zap all your money. That's weird. But I'm gonna watch this for a couple of days, maybe because this 20 million hit and all this videos went away that, that sent like a shock. Still happened May 21st. But yeah, it's very strange, very, very strange.